today, all women, all women over the age of 30 should get tested for the human papillomavirus, or HPV. That's according to a new study out today. Medical reporter Janet St. James is here with details on this. I mean, they're really saying everybody. Well, yes, everyone over 30. But I want to make it very clear that we're talking about, not talking about the somewhat controversial HPV vaccine. vaccine. Mm -hmm. Right. This is a screening test. And this was a very large study of more than 50,000 women printed in the Lancet Oncology. It showed an HPV test was a better screening method to prevent cancer than the common pap smear. Now, a pap test, like women are supposed to get annually, checks for cell changes in the cervix that might indicate an infection or cancerous cells. An HPV test is done the very same way, but checks for the virus's DNA. According to the study, HPV tests discovered significantly more cell changes. Women who had that test had far fewer cancers than women who didn't in the study. The HPV test is already widely used in North Texas as part of an annual exam because previous studies have already shown its value. We've been doing the, D the HPV DNA test in our practice now for about seven years. And I've actually had patients who've had negative PAPs for five to seven or ten years in a row and had an HPV test that was positive and actually had cervical cancer. So I think we're headed in that direction. We just don't have the data yet. I think we're just getting to that point now where we're going to see studies that indicate that the HPV test is probably more accurate as a primary screen. HPV is especially common in younger women. Most clear the virus without treatment in a matter of months. So experts really believe that age 30 is the right time to start HPV testing when abnormal results could indicate something more serious. And yes, it's covered by most insurance, Medicaid after age 30, and Medicare, Shelley. And we were talking about this earlier in the newsroom, and I kind of felt like, what, what's my problem? I didn't know. Right. So I posted on my Facebook. It says, ladies over 30, do you know if you've even had this HPV test? And as you can see, Janet, Almost everybody said no. Half the folks said we don't know, and nobody said yes. It's not surprising because they would do this at the same time that you would do a pap smear, so it's not surprising that you wouldn't know. You probably wouldn't get it every year, maybe once every other year, every mm -hmm. three years. You should ask your doctor. Just to make sure. ask. It's mm -hmm. probably inclusive, yes. but you've got to ask. ask. Okay, thank you, Janet.